with. One is they can both be standing up to the 30 minute time limit. That being the case, they will split the $20,000. Now, one more thing, Diamond Lee. Let me remind our fans out there that the one who draws first blood, be it the Luscious Leaks or the Magnificent Meaty, they will get $5,000. This is for all the marbles. The whole enchilada, Diamond Lee, you will put one together, brother. This is, this is for the belt. This is for the championship. champion, the Magnificent Mimi, ready, the challenger, Luscious Lisa, and as we said before, there is absolutely no love lost between these two athletes, and I don't think either one of them wants to split that $20,000 two ways. <laughs> they want the whole thing, and they both want first blood. We are ready for one of the most historic and one of the most exciting events in all of sport. It will be the Blood Bass Spectacular. You know what it's going to be. It's going to be a double D bam. Lisa, the magnificent Mimi, right away, collar and elbow, into the ropes goes Mimi, nice snap there by Luscious Lisa, tremendous move, Zuka Davis right away on the veteran, that she intends to take that belt as at all possible, Mimi, she's already hot, two hip locks and a third hip lock, and that's got to frustrate the magnificent one, three tremendous moves right out of the gate by Luscious Lisa, and what a drop goal hole, that's what I'm talking about, Dave, that is a veteran move. championship match. Only two ways to win it. You either win it one, two, three in the middle of the ring, or you win it by submission. Disqualifications won't get it. Over the top won't get it. Time limits won't get it. Out of the ring won't get it. Good hammer lock by Lisa. Put more, yo, more pressure. Ah, that radiates right up into the back of the neck. Look at this, she's gonna break by the leg. Oh! I'll tell you what. In the first two and a half minutes of this fight, I guarantee you, Diamond Dave, Magnificent Mimi will remember where she was tonight. Still holding on to that hammerlock. Look at the look of determination on Magnificent Mimi in a power move. She had a reverse that would be a body rack, but right now, just dumps Luscious Lisa down. Thunderous introduction to the mat, and now Mimi's starting to put the boots to Luscious Lisa. You know, if there's one pump handle, one criticism I've ever had of Magnificent Mimi, is she plays to the crowd. She'll get her opponent in a compromising position, and she'll start talking to the crowd. I mean, these... Oh, what a knee lift by Mimi! I've never understood this, Diamond Dave. I mean, these young ladies don't get paid by the hour. I would think they'd want to get in there and get out of there as quickly as possible. Look at this, cranking her up, cranking her up like an old bitch. Oh, no, and down goes Lisa! First blood from their opponent is five thousand dollars richer. My step over by my Absolutely, at this point anyway, having her way with the champion. It sure is. And how do you like the way she's working this crowd, huh? I think it's tremendous. The crowd obviously loving Lisa, the magnificent Mimi, long time a champion of the American Angel. You know, Diamond Day, you don't get the new champion by flipping coupons or winning some sort of lottery. Yeah, be bad. Reversal, look at this. Hip lock and down goes Mimi. I think she's absolutely confused. I've got to believe that Luscious Lisa came in here with a battle plan. Mimi came in here on sheer cockiness and reversal again into a hip lock. This young lady is showing the magnificent one more than she bargained for. All right, she's showing us a rookie mistake right there. She should have gone right after the magnificent one when she had an opportunity. She gave Mimi a chance that no wrestler is ever going to live to talk about, and that is to give Mimi her second win. And she just took the win right out of the luscious one.
knees into the midsection. And look at the termination on the face of the magnificent Mimi. Reversal by Lisa. That's what I mean. She's got to move in there. She's got to move in there. Got just a little bit too late. He or she who hesitates is lost, and Lisa was absolutely lost on that. Well, I don't know if she's going to get up. The magnificent one is going to introduce her to the bottom of her shoe first. Mimi is not above putting the boots to anybody. I've seen her do it to some of the guys. Oh, in the ring apron head first goes Luscious Lisa. Compliments of the Magnificent Mimi. We're going for first blood here, Dave. Don't forget, $5,000 for whoever can draw first blood on their opponent. Right the small of her back on the edge of the ring. That has got to hurt. That has got to hurt. I think she's trying to get Lisa to just give it up at this point. He's about 100 pounds and about as tough as they come. But if you fans have heard me say on television many times, at 125 pounds, you will never find that much toughness put into that much weight. And I'm talking about the magnificent Mimi. She's got herself perched on the top of the ropes now. What she's got in store for Lisa. Oh, guillotine leg drop from the top rope. A check, see if she's your first one on that. No, no. I thought she was going to bust Lisa open with that one, but she did not. She sat there by the hair. Lisa holds on to her back, but the top of her head can't be feeling any much better. I guarantee you one thing, Dominique, both magnificent Lisa and Lisa's Lisa are going to remember where they were tonight. It's out of the box. Lisa went in as a rookie. She's coming out of the road. She's coming out of the season. white on rice. That's something that Lisa, I guarantee, is going to learn. If nothing else, she's going to learn that tonight. Marina, what's she doing in there? I'm telling you, she gets in the middle of this one. She is looking for real trouble. Look at the look on Magnificent Mimi taking Lisa into the skin and dumps her. And here's the mistake that Mimi makes. She'll start playing to the crowd, posturing to the crowd. How am I doing, she'll be asking So many times she's going up on the top rope. I think she thinks she's got Lisa's leg injured. And then she's like, oh, right down on the left leg. But that's smart wrestling down in day. You find the weak point in your opponent, you go to work on it. You pick out one single body part, and you go to work on it. Quite obviously, Mimi thinks that she can take Luscious Lisa down by doing away with her left leg. Lisa's got to kick out of there. She just cannot stay there on that rope. But for all we know, that leg very well could be broken and she can't move it. She's got to make a move. Here comes Mimi. Oh, she possumed her. She sucked her right in there. Oh, Mimi has got to have the wind knocked out of her. But Lisa can't even stand up on that leg, Dave. Oh, the drop kick. She got her 
right in the kisser. We could see first blood on that. I got a good look at the magnificent one, but she landed square. You're right, that's right, first blood. $5,000, if nothing else, $5,000 on the first blood. All that's going to do is make her hotter. She is taking the absolute beating of her life tonight. Oh, took her all the way vertical down for the suplex. Diamond Dave, I don't care about this crowd. They're not in there getting the boots put to them by the magnificent meanie. It's Luscious Lisa. I mean, this girl is still a rookie. Let's be realistic. Let's be honest with you. 